You too, what's up? This is Who is King Sean, and we back again with another classic. You know, on this channel, we talk about personal credit, we talk about business credit, we talk about anything that can help you and your family get to the next level. So if you want a one-on-one with me, all you need to do is hit the description right below this video, hit my site, pick your day and time, and we can lock in on that personal side and that business side and really turn you up for 2023. And for all those that's still interested in my ultimate credit repair guide, you can get that right on my website at who is King Sean.com. So let's get right to the video. I've been cleaning up my Instagram DM. I got over 175 messages. So this is what I'm gonna do for everybody. I'm gonna need everybody to lock in for the next 45 days because I will be dropping a video for the next 45 days and it's gonna be answering everybody questions that have been sending me messages to my Instagram. First video today is from my favorite bank, Navy Federal Credit Union. Um, I'm starting with the list from the top to the bottom. So eventually, if you ask me a question, a video will be dropped on there. So I have a person um, that sent me a message and they're trying to get a home mortgage through Navy Federal. They're having a little issue with the final approval with the underwriters because their debt to ratio you know, is really up there. And that's the only thing holding them back. Now I'm gonna tell you, now I asked this person, um, are you a working person or do you own a business? What do you got going on? They verified to me that they do have a business for the past year. Um, they do have an LC and they do got money generating through their business checking account. So I told them that's a plus. All you need to do, this is simple, this is easy. For now on in the future, when it comes to something like this, and for anybody that's listening, you should listen clearly so you can take these notes. Now, if you have an LLC, S Corp, C Corp, or whatever, you got money generated in and out. You and you, you're thinking about buying a home within the next 12 to 24 months, right? What you should be doing today. So let's say you got a personal loan. Let's say you got an auto loan. Let's say you got some credit card payments that you're making all through your personal uh, checking account. I don't want to get y'all confused, so I'm going to stay with one thing. So let's say you have an auto loan, right? Remember, you could use all three, but we're going to start because, you know, people will get confused and they'll be in the comments. So let's say you have an auto loan and your payment is uh, $700 a month, right? So think about it, people. $700 a month times 12 months, right? That's $8,400. So that might be out your range when it comes to the lenders approving you, right? So what you need to do is that you need to today, you got this business going on, you got a business checking account, you got some kind of money generating in and out of that, you need to set up auto pay like I do. You know, um, I always did this even from the beginning to my journey now, which now um, I get properties and um, cars in my business name. But at the beginning of my journey, I'm, the steps I'm telling you, this the steps I did, right? So I set up auto, my auto payment car loan with my business checking account, right? Once you get 12 months bank statements, right? You could provide these statements of 12 months that you're making your auto loan through your business checking account. They cannot hold it against you. Let me say it again. They cannot hold this against you if you make those 12 payments from your business checking account for whatever it may be like i said that auto loan that personal loan or that credit card that you're making every month you know um this is an easy hack that i've been following from some years so people that's you know interested in getting a home do navy federal they got some decent rates going on right now it's not excellent but it's better. People need to stop using your debit card and start using what? Start using business credit cards. You got a, you know, you got a LCC Corp, S Corp, all these things. Why are you not having business credit cards and not running everything through that business credit card so you could keep your debt over there? So again, um, when you get approved, these lenders will be asking. Once you let them know that, they will be asking for documents from your business checking account that you could provide and show that your auto loan is being paid 
by your business checking account and not through your personal one and they cannot hold it against you and remember consult with a mortgage professional with anything you do no matter who tells you anything i mean your parents uh a cousin friend um anybody a mentor whatever they do you know sit down with somebody professional in that field that deal with mortgages and ask the ask them these questions this is simple and this is easy again but you got to be able to provide 12 month payment documents from your business checking account so they don't hold that against you and um this is an easy way to kind of um get these approvals without having all this debt holding over your head you know a lot of people um they're going for home loans but this is the problem the problem is they have so much debt so this is a quick hack how you can hide the debt um by having it being paid from your business checking account and not through your personal again people get in the comments tell me what you think if you know about this get in the comments again let me say it again consult with your mortgage professional so to the person that sent me that message on my Instagram, asking me what he could do right now in the future, like I said, and for anybody else, you need 12 months of payments from your business checking account, showing the lenders that is being paid through your business because you're generating money and not through your personal. And then at that point, you won't have to worry about your debt to income ratio. Get in the comment, like, comment, subscribe. But for now, I'm up out of here. Peace.